What is going on ladies and gentlemen, once again Legacy Kill HD back with another Black Ops 3 video. Today we're going to be concentrating on zombies. A lot of details have merged in the past 24 to 48 hours and we're going to be going through that today. But I also want to uh, ask if you guys do enjoy the video or find it any bit informative by the end, uh, please smack that like button also to share your thoughts. Now let's get down into the news. So guys, we're first going to start with an email that Activision sent a bunch of German people. And it's kind of weird because there's nothing in the actual uh, description or anything of the email. It's just the subject line. And the subject line, I'm not even going to try saying it, but the equivalent, what it says in English is all, goods th all good things come in three. And a lot of people are making the assumption now that maybe the, that may be the uh, first Black Ops 3 actual confirmation from Activision. And honestly, I think it could be a possibility, but a lot of people are also saying it could be another game like Spider-Man 3 or something of that sort. I'm not exactly sure what Activision... They are a publisher and they do a lot of games, but uh, this, in my mind, it does kind of make sense that it would be for Black Ops 3. But it is interesting that it was just sent to German people in German and there was nothing else in like the description or anything. But I did want to let that let you guys know on that. Now let's get to our next subject, which is another zombie leak from the same guy who brought us the information yesterday, the Goblin 30. But the one thing that's interesting about this is that it was deleted. So this is actually what it says. Okay, I have more news regarding Call of Duty 2014. In my previous post, I talked about the campaign in Zombies, and there was much question on what on what I started, well, stated about Zombies returning. I stated that Zombies will be returning in Black Ops 3 in the next Call of Duty, but with new and added game modes such as TDM Free For All, a new game mode that yet has a name, and Survival Mode. To clear up what I said about the new game modes for Zombies, Zombie TDM will be very much like multiplayer DDM, but will have perks and every time you get killed by a player you respawn. If you get killed by a zombie you die. Same for free for all. Also in Black Ops 3 campaign it will uh, it will be explained how zombies came about, where zombies all started. Now I don't know much more news about Call of Duty Black Ops 3 than what I stated in my last post, but I just wanted to clear up on what I had previously previously uh, shared about zombies returning in Black Ops 3 2014. The game will be released on the current and last gen consoles. Once again guys, I already told you my skepticism on this and if you want to see the other information that was revealed from this guy, uh, there will be an annotation probably at the end of the video and also you can just go on my channel and find it probably really pretty fast since it's uh, just a video or two before this. But uh, I already told you I don't, I'm not sure if this is fake or real, but this does also bring up another subject and it's a Daisy style zombie game mode. And that's what I'm thinking about free for all and TDM I just see it as something that would really make sense like think about just having a huge open world setting an open world map maybe this is just something for uh, next gen since they'll have a lot more to work with and uh, well I still call it next gen I guess you could still well you should be calling it current gen right now but um, they could have like a war huge map and you just scavenge around and it's a uh, player versus player and maybe zombies have a bigger role in this and I'm sure you can also ha just have weapons hanging around and stuff but I just really think a Daisy style mode would be really fun and uh, something innovative that we haven't seen in Call of Duty zombies yet that a lot of people would enjoy and I think it would be something that a lot of people would be playing every I, I think every day honestly I just I'm a huge fan of Daisy and I think this would be something like I said very innovative so and back to this post legitimacy I don't for one second really believe this but it does raise a lot of questions but I did want to let you guys know this because I've already said enough times last year I doubted the uh, Call of Duty ghost little leaks or whatever and uh, that came from a drifter and well it ended up being true anyway guys let's move on to the next subject of the day and this is a teaser image that was supposedly given out well it was shown by Treyarch months ago but it recently just gained attention and the reason why it gained attention was because they made it their Twitter uh, app, Twitter picture, or whatever. And the one thing that you need to take out of this is that it has two countries on it, Japan and Russia. And this brings up a date, 1905. And that is a war between Russia and Japan. And a lot of people have been making the assumption, hey, maybe we're going to get an actual before origins um, for this. I'm not exactly sure how they would work out this, but it does look interesting and it raises a lot of questions on where Zombies is heading because a lot of people are making the assumptions that we're going to head back to World War II. Maybe we're heading even further back. 
So in this picture, also you see a bunch of various weapons that fit that area. You got a machete, uh, some type of handgun, and some other weapons. But anyway, guys, um, that is all I have for you today. Let me know what you think of this image because I don't know what to make out of it really. But all I know is that there was a war between Russia and Japan in uh, between 1904 and 1905, and a lot of people have been making the assumption, "Hey, zombies is probably gonna uh, go back," and this is our first teaser image of it. But anyway, guys, I am Legacy Kill HD, one of your best sources for news and information on Call of Duty Zombies, and I hope you guys enjoyed this packed video with a bunch of information. Let me know your thoughts on all the subjects, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.